back with an all new mating game. Something great folks I have to say. Take it away, Chink! Why? Thank you, Antique Parts Bills. And welcome back to an all new mating game. We're returning as our bachelor and hounds. Hey, everybody, I'm back. I'm so excited. <laughs> A new bachelorette. Call him Manunu Iona! Everybody! Oh my god, what the hell? And? I think she's possessed. Call the priest! And another Ed? <laughs> Don't worry, I cried enough on every boat, though. Returning! Arlene Mozart! I guess I got married. We are married! They've been married for years. They have fucking ten year old boy. Hell, where yeah. do you fucking keep up? How old am I? Fred? Yeah. How many years have passed I've been doing this damn show? Who knows? At least I didn't age. <laughs> I don't know. And our third chair, as always, Ed Pope. What the hell kind of introduction is that? I'm yeah. sorry, I'm sorry. Hey, Poe! That's fucking better. He deserves a better intro. I can do better than that. Then do it. And the third chair is always Ed Poke! Hell yeah! That's a good one there. Thank you, Brian. Drink that tank! Excuse me. Butthead. And of course on our cameras always. Fred! Hey, Fred! Hi, Tank, how are you? I'm doing good. How are you doing today, Fred? I'm doing good. I'm sorry for the show. Excellent day. Alright, Ed, go with your first question. I don't have no... Not you, Ed Helms! You said Ed. I'm used to answering when the Ed is called. Where in that... What? Who sent me a dragon? Probably Aloise. Gosh damn it. Why does Aloise send dragons? <laughs> I don't know. I got a train. I got a damn boxing glove. I don't know what the hell... Can you open it? Hi, honey. Hi, Wolfgang. Hi, Mom. I'm on here today. I'm going to be on Felipe next week. That's exciting. We'll be in the audience. It. Huh. Bachelorette number two. Yeah. Ed is a very happy person. I love to sing. I love to dance. What do you like to do? I like to drink whiskey and yell at my son and my husband. What? That's what I do every day. He, she does, Mom, every day. My husband says I have a lyrical voice. It is quite lyrical, I say. What do you think, Caleb? It, it's like music to my ears, Mom. He loves it. He thinks it's sexy. Hey, Caleb, watch this. Hey, honey, how are you? He likes it. He thinks it's sexy. Who the hell's singing? Ed singing. Ed, you got a hell of a voice. Why, thank you. Bachelorette number one. Yes. Oh, my God. Ed is always a happy person. I love to dance and sing. What do you, what do I, what do you like to do? I love to sing. Uh. Ah! How do you sing? <laughs> That's weird. Her voice is fucking gravelly and fucking low, but now it's high. I don't know what the hell's going on. Why are you here. crying, Ed? I always cry on this show. Why are you upset this time? I. Who the hell knows? Past memories? Shut up, chair! I don't know what she's talking to, but whatever. <laughs> person loves to sing and dance. What do you like to do? I like to dance. I'm a stripper. What the fuck did I get a damn squid from? I am you ass. I'm gonna whoop your ass. Oh, I can't help it. Oh, God. But anyway, I like to sing. I like to dance. I, I'm not really singing that much. My damn neck is just like some bug bit me. I like to drink beer and eat fucking shit loads of ham. Hell yeah. Oh, thank you. 
Go ahead. Bachelorette number one! Yeah! Oh my god, I think she's getting worse. Need a cough drop? No, I'm fine, thanks. Alright, then. <laughs> yeah, Luby, I shot too. Oh, oh, my husband likes to plant a lot of wheat and stuff at his house. What kind of plants do you like? Seaweed, coral. I'm a siren. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Suave. That's Laura number one. That damn squid again with the house going on. Oh, didn't mean to send it, Ed. All right, then. It can really cuss a fucking crush a cuss a can. Uh, who the hell cusses cans? I do sometimes. Any, anyway, that's the right number one. Um, I was, I was gonna ask the question. Go for it, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Ed loves the outdoors. Ed loves to camp, fish, and all that fun stuff. You like to camp and fish? I love the outdoors. I love to swim. I love to sing. And I love to lure you to my rock where I can eat your eyeballs out. Ah! 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 <laughs> you see me a dragon. Sorry. I hate Bob Polly too. <laughs> She turned country. Uh oh, did we play the fucking bills. That's Lauren number two. Yeah. I love the outdoors. I like to fish and camp and all. I love the outdoors myself. And my family, myself, not planning on camping soon. It's gonna be fun for all kinds of experience, all that. And along with that, get stung, not stung, bit by mosquitoes. You're saying you're gonna be long and naked? No! Is that what you're saying? He's gonna experience the outdoors and he's gonna get bit by mosquitoes! I thought you said he's gonna be long and naked. What? I have no idea. I said he's gonna experience the outdoors! And he, I, I, almost, I almost said he got, he's gonna get stung by mosquitoes! Oh, I'm glad I guess you. I thought I heard stung and, and, and long and naked from I have no idea. Uh, I guess he might take his clothes off from the mosquito bites and shower. I guess. Room number three. Yeah. I like to camp and fish and all that fun stuff. I love the outdoors. Do you like to camp and fish and stuff? I'm not really an outdoorsy type. I don't like hot weather. But I do like to fish and stuff every once in a while. I don't mind camping so much. I've got some fucking bear ham and, you know, fucking TV stereo. You know, the cameras at home, I'm fine with it then, maybe, for a little while. Okay. <laughs> Bethlehem number two. Yeah? I love trees. I think they're beautiful. Some have flowers on them. Some have beautiful colored leaves. What would you say your favorite tree is? Mine is oak. I love the weeping willows. <clears throat> Ooh, those are nice, too. They're, they're shady. Now, as a kid... I would read a book and then just relax under the tree. Oh. <laughs> that sounds like a nice, nice the time. It is. Who sent me a fucking dragon? Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> number one. <laughs> what? <laughs> Scary. <laughs> I love trees. My favorite is a <laughs> oak. What's your favorite tree? Palm <laughs> <laughs> trees. It makes sense, I guess. You tropical, so yeah. <laughs> That's one number three. Yeah. What the hell? Uh -huh. <clears throat> What's wrong with you, Ed? I have no idea. Are you scared of that, of that time I knew who? Yeah, I kind of am. She's fucking creepy as hell. What's the damn priest was here today? He ain't, apparently. Well, Ed, I say my favorite tree. Yeah, it's a pecan tree. It's pronounced pecan. I say pecan. That's the way it is. Oh, the lights are coming on now, at least. Thank you, Ed. You're welcome. Butler at number one. What? 
I'm not really an alcohol drinker or anything like that. I just like to have fun and drink orange juice and stuff like that. What do you like to drink when you go out? Me? I like to drink. What? Good God! Does every contestant cry? Apparently so. I never cry. That's Laura number two? Yeah. I'm not really an alcohol drinker. What? You're not an alcohol drinker? What's wrong with you? Are you a dang wimp? I do drink every once in a blue moon. I just don't like to get messed up. I like my head straight. Who's calling? You've been chosen. They will s come soon. What the hell? Wait, who is this? <sighs> Oh, uh, you just got franked. Brittany Cho. Brittany, you fucking bitch, you! Anyway, I like to drink whiskey and stuff every day. Okay. And I get drunk, and I'm drunk right now. <clears throat> I think. Let's uh, see. That's room number three. Uh, I'm a bar drinker. I do like whiskey, though, every once in a while. Especially when Arlene's here, I'll drink some with her. I got some with me! <clears throat> but I love alcohol. <clears throat> see. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Excuse me, number one. What? This is <clears throat> I like shaking in a skin. Emma, Emma, uh. Just ask the question! I'm trying to. I, I'm shaking. I can't help it. It's a little chilly, you know. No, you're scared. That, that too. But anyway. I love animals. All kinds of animals. Do you like animals? Mmm, I sure do. They're crunchy. Ah! No! Oh! The poor bunny! <laughs> Bachelor number two? Bachelorette! And I'm sorry. Bachelorette number two? Yeah? I love animals too. You like animals? I love animals! My parents live on a farm. They have a bunch of them. My favorite animal's a horse. But I plan on getting my son Wolfgang a dog soon. That's good. Where are you Wolfgang? Hey, Roy! Yay! What kind of dog do you want? I don't know. I'll take it. It's a look. Alright, we will. Bachelor number three. Yeah, you do. love animals. Do you, do you <laughs> like animals? Oh, They're all right. I'm not really a big yeah. animal person. I do have a cat though, Mr. Uh, the Mayor. Uh, I adopted him on my Let's Play with Nicole. And you have a hamster named Hammy. Yeah, and I have a hamster named Hammy, so you know I do like him, but <clears throat> I don't normally have one. But I thought I'd have you know a little something on there. That's nice. Let's learn oh, at number two. <laughs> yeah, honey. <clears throat> I've been in several movies. I, I've been in um, Captain Underpants. I've been in the Lorax movie. I was in a show for several years. Have you ever done any acting? Yeah, we have a Lorax play going on right now. It's called the Mozarts. I love that I've seen it. It's it's amazing. Yeah, it's so funny. I love it. I I, I thought you looked familiar. It sounded familiar. We have three parts recorded so far. <coughs> I can't wait to see the next episode. It'll be good, I'm sure. That's the rant number one. What? I am an actor. I've been in several movies and TV shows. Have you ever done any acting? No. Liza. You be perfect for. You fart or what? I have no idea. Did you fart? No. What the heck did you do? I don't know. That's what number three. I'm an actor. I've been in movies and TV show. You ever done any acting? Well, I'm on Let's Play Zone Fashion Issa Sim and at Jenny Sims uh, channels on YouTube, so I guess I am an actor. You'll be in the new one soon, Ed. <clears throat> Alright, Ed, go with your last question. Alright, thank you, team. 
Bachelor number one. What? Your favorite color is blue. What's yours? Mine is red, like blood. Yes. Ah! <laughs> 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 it's scared. That's so. What's your gore? That's Laura number two. Hi, Ed. The cool. I wish you were up here with Ed. You want a hug later? I do. Yeah. My favorite color is blue. What's your favorite color? I love blue too. That's nice. That's one number three. Yeah, my favorite color is blue, like my pretty blue eyes. Thank you. All right, we're right back at this brief commercial. All right, we're back at that brief commercial. Hey, would you like to be bachelorette number one? Let's learn number two. Why are you scared? Oh, she's scary. I'm not scary. No, you're married. I know. Or bachelor number three. I, I do love Ed Pope, but, you know, I, I guess I'll have to pick bachelor number, bachelorette number one. Come on out, bachelorette number one. You've been chosen. Good uh, luck, honey. Well, thanks. It was nice meeting you. You too. Well, yeah. you know, Fred, hi, Fred. I'm back. I'm going to go swimming. I get the heck out of here. Damn, Ed, you have a nice ass. Well, thank you. Oh, I don't know what to do. I'm nervous. How scared are you, Ed? I'm terrified. Hi. Oh. 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 What? Hi, nice to meet you. I feel very different now. Who is that? You're very lovely. Uh -huh. Good! Let's go to my rock! Okay, let's go. Well, I think she put him under her spell. Yeah, hey, come on, dragon first! Cool. Uh oh, something's wrong with Ed. Why in the hell is there always boxing on? I don't know! Well, I'd say he was terrified, but she put him at ease, so what can I tell you? Ed. See you next week, folks, for an all new mating game. I'm Tink Farspells. Have a nice evening! Thank you so much, Tink. I think Ed's a little cold because it's he's in his swim trunks. Well, to Ed was terrified, and I can understand why. She sounded like she was some kind of demon possessed woman. I have no idea. But she quickly put her him under her spell, so he's fine now. He's flirty and all kinds of magical shit's happening. So I would say that hopefully if she doesn't eat him later, they'll have a pretty good date. We'll see what happens if Ed comes back. <laughs> Poor Ed. Ed, get out of it! I guess I, guess I had to save him. I guess, we'll have, I guess I'll have to too. Yeah, let's get out of here and save him. I gotta look at this fucking boxing game first. Well, thanks so much everyone, and what do we say? Goodbye everybody! Hell yeah! Hell yeah!